I have a gym. My gym is to travel around the world and learn, see different kind of place and learn like different kind of culture. And I was thinking in my trip, doing my trip, how am I going to remember my memories and won't forget about it? So, because you, you guys know that the gift shop is, the gift is so expensive for us to afford that, like, it costs too much. So I have been thinking, this is the postcard that, I mean, like, I finally found a way that is represent, I mean, is like helping me to, um, to memorize the chip, and this is my culture artifact also. Um, this is one of the most significant books cut for me because I got this from Great Canyon, Arizona. And that's the most furthest trip that I just gone in the USA. And the back of it, I mean on the background of it is a eagle point. Do you see like the eagles are living on the mountain? So that's why they call it as the eagle point. I have connection with this car, this postcard because I was really in this place and bought this postcard and I'm not asking for someone else to buy it for me. By sharing this postcard, I hope you have better understanding the culture of individuals who like to travel. Uh, in this speech, I, first I will talk about how I related to this po uh, this travel culture. Second, I, I mean, oh wait. First, I, I will tell you how this postcard is related to the travel um, culture, and then I will, second, I will tell you how I related to the travel culture. The postcard is represented the travel culture. In this modern day, I think like times change very fast, and then the viewers uh, change also. When you go, I mean, if you go to Las Vegas for ten years ago, and you go now, that's definitely a huge difference, right? And maybe you can no longer find the memories of like the place that you have been for ten years ago, and that's gone for now. The postcard helped me to remember and refresh my memory every time I take out of it because everything is changed, the postcard wasn't changed. Once the picture is captured, and then that's what it was. And second, I, I mean, I wanted I, my friends, I, I have a lot of friends that travel, like to travel like me. Every time they travel, and then they you buy a postcard also. And every postcard, there's a unique a picture, and then there's a unique description also. And there's one time was my birthday, and then I got a postcard for my mail. And that's what surprised me, because my friend was in Disneyland, they sent me a postcard. And mm -hmm. I was feel like they care about me, and then I got my postcard on my birthday, mm -hmm. so I was feeling and then I share I share part of my culture through sending postcard. I share I share happiness to my family and friends when I travel to different countries. I mean to different place. I like to send postcard to them to show to tell them that I was really like this place and I was wanting to share my happiness to you. In addition, every postcard have a own description on the back right. In this car, in this one, they have a. Like they told me what the eco phones and like, and there's a picture on it also. And so they can get more information about the place and then the most expensive, I mean the most important thing is like postcard is not expensive. It's only a cost of 50 cents or one dollar so you can get one. And then um, in conclusion, I, oh my God. I see this as a traditional of myself. My parents always telling me like, why you all, like, why you sending postcard? I mean, instead of sending home, or make, I mean, instead of sending email or making phone call, that's faster than like you sending a postcard. And the postcard will get loose like while it's delivery. But I just tell them like, I wanted to let people, let my friends or family know that I was care about them, so I use the old way to write it, use the old way to send you my greeting to them. In the oldest time, people used to write letter to uh, write letter to their friends and family to greet them, like telling them that I was there, I was care about them. So I hope in, up 
after the speech, I hope you have better understanding of of um, how of the postcard and the travel culture that is represented. First, I I discuss how postcards related to me and how I represented post. I mean, how it represented culture, travel culture. Second, I discuss how I related to the travel culture. So next time, if you go to a trip, so I wish you guys can like pay more attention about the postcard and maybe you can send one postcard.